welcome to our channel civil engineering world so if you are new please make sure to subscribe our channel civil engineering world for the latest videos and lectures today we are going to learn about different types of dams that we use in order to store and transfer water so starting from basic definition of dam dam is a barrier which is constructed to hold back water and raise its level basically forming a reservoir to generate electricity as a water supply so there are two classifications of dam based on function and based on structure and its design so let's get into detail based on function that dams are classified as storage dam diversion dam detention dam debris dam and coffer dam so uh, storage dam is the dam which is used to store water by raising its level on upstream diversion dam is that type of dam which is used to divert water in order to change its angle detention dam is used to store water during heavy rains and floods and then after rain the water is allowed to flow through spillway slowly in order to reduce damage during floods so in case of debris dam it is used and constructed in those places where there is risk of big stones and debris which can come into the downstream during high flood and rainy seasons coffer dam is used to build on those places where if any type of construction is going on so based on structure and design the dams are classified as gravity dams arch dams buttress dam embankment dam steel dam timber dam and rubber dam so gravity dam as you can see in the picture it resists the lateral forces of water due to its own weight so it may be made up of concrete so in case of arch dam the arch which is a structural member is used to resist the lateral pressure of water so in case of buttress dam there is a long wall which is supported by these buttresses along its side throughout the length so the lateral forces of water is resisted by this buttress and also lateral wall so in case of embankment wall as you can see there is a slope there is a constant slope and it look, looks like an embankment so that's why its name is embankment so it resists to all due to its slope so there are also other types which include steel dams so in steel dams there are footings uh, which are constructed on the soil and this and then the upstream side water is resisted by a steel member which is further supported by cantilever strut these steel members and foundations are anchored in ground moving to the timber dam this is made up of wood uh, so this type of dam has been used anci anciently in old ages so actually in this type of dams wood panels are used to construct the walls and spillways and water level is raised on upstream so in case of rubber dam water is raised by using synthetic rubber materials which are used perpendicular to the water flow and thus the water of on upstream can easily raised hope you have learned from this video don't forget to subscribe our channel civil engineering world and make sure to click on bell icon in order to get the latest videos